Alright, hello everyone, it's Happy, and you guys know what this video is going to be about. It's about the worst thing that can literally happen to you in any game. It's called ammo racking, or specifically when you get your bomb ammo racked and uh, pretty much destroyed in one shot. Now, in my opinion, I think ammo racks should be technically removed from the game because uh, blitz is more or less becoming a competitive game and i don't think that uh, something like this should be happening in any game especially blitz that is very very competitive now i'll give my reasons as to why you guys should listen to me to the very end and then tell me what you guys think in the comment section below so firstly Ammo racking is close or more or less close to skill, but m the majority of the time it is more or less related towards luck. The fact that uh, the ammo rack will actually explode rather than being uh, critically hit. So uh, I think the ammo rack being critically hit should be left in the game as it, it's a game mechanic, it's a good game mechanic. It, uh, it means that you should protect your modules, it, it, it shows that you can shoot the same place twice, you have module knowledge, etc, etc, but blowing a tank off in just one shot is completely unnecessary, it literally ruins your statistics, and uh, you know, it's something very, very unnecessary. You know, let's say you're sweating for damage or something like this, and then you peek out and you die. Believe me, this has happened to me so many times, I've played in the Chieftain uh, at tier 10, I've been ammo like twice and I got really really mad I literally poked around the corner to trade shots and boom I got ammo racked and I instantly died I got triggered same thing with the is7 I'm rolling around you just get smacked into the side or into the front and you blow up it's really really annoying especially when you're full HP same thing happens with a lot of Soviet tanks like the object 140 T62, T44, I think a lot of you guys know what I'm talking about. Of course, having the ammo rack critically hit is completely fine. Again, it's part of the game mechanic, but allowing for a whole tank to be blown up by chance, I think it's just too much. It's far too much, and uh, we've seen it far too much as well. Same thing goes with competitive gameplay. Let's say you're playing a tournament, and one of your teammates just gets ammo racked. That's so devastating. It's a six versus seven, and again, it's very much up to chance. It's not just 100% skill. The big, uh, the big portion of it is up to luck. It's up to RNG. If RNG says yes, you're going to blow someone's face off. If it says no, you're gonna get your face blown off and uh, it's not it's not very nice it's not very nice let's be honest uh, furthermore apart from competitive play again it affects your stats a lot dying with a zero is really 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 devastating let's be honest if you're having a session for you know 4k whatever and you're trying to sweat for damage or you're trying to get a win rate up and then you get ammo racked all of a sudden out of nowhere just by a random shot uh, from a 40% player, you know, it's just very very unfair at least in my opinion You already have two red flags and uh, I don't think it benefits anyone uh, Let's be honest Amorax benefits no one apart from when you do it you get that glimpse of joy But the majority of times it's you being Amorax. Let's be honest I've been blown up more than I've actually Amorax someone. I obviously critically hit someone's Amorax but uh, most of the time I'm rolling around in my IS-7 or uh, or my T62 and I just get smacked into the side by a Death Star and I go kaput. And uh, I think everyone knows this and uh, I just think it should be removed from the game. Now before you guys go hate on me, this is just my opinion. So uh, again, I just want to know if you guys agree or disagree with me. There will be people that will say, oh, it's part of the game mechanic, it's part of the game, it's meant to be realistic. But guys, World of Tanks Blitz is an arcade game. It's not meant to be realistic. It's not a realistic game. Come on, you have tanks like Annihilators and Smashers running around. So uh, it's not really a realistic tank. You have tanks like the Grave Digger, blah blah blah, etc. etc. So, um, I mean, the realistic argument doesn't really uphold here. The, the game is arcadey, and I think it should stay more or less arcadey. Burning tanks is, uh, is again a pretty good game mechanic, in my opinion. And same with uh, ammo racking or critically hitting the ammo rack, but not blowing it up. I think uh, your reload time should decrease because module, uh, module, um, 
positioning is quite important in terms of skill it shows that you have some sort of skill you have some sort of knowledge etc etc but uh, blowing a tank up just randomly should literally be removed from the game i think uh, this is just a really really um you know outdated feature that was added to the game ages ago in the very beginning and uh, i don't think it should be part of the game nowadays but uh, I really want to know what you guys think about this, so uh, tell me in the comment section below if you agree with me, maybe you disagree with me, but uh, don't hate, it's just an opinion. So with that, this video comes to an end, if you guys enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time, happy is out, bye bye.